little scratch on that capsule there. Ah, uh, more American Silver Eagles. Oh, wow. Well, hello, my friends, and welcome to another episode of Weekly Bullion. Today, we've got two beautiful boxes to open today. Inside these boxes, we're gonna find a little bit of silver and a little bit of gold. And I think you're gonna like the contents that are in this box. Now, before we get started, if you don't mind, go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed to the channel. And while you're there, go ahead and hit that like button. That'll help push this video out to more people just like us who enjoy precious metals. Let's get right to the contents of the box. All right, let's go ahead and open this. Nicely packaged. Okay, what have we here? Let's go ahead and set these off to the side for now. And let's look at these. This is a very beautiful 2007 Australian kookaburra. And this is a very beautiful coin with a finish. It's got wonderful luster. And as we turn around, we see Her Majesty. A little scratch on that capsule there. Not too excited about that. I might have to put this in a different capsule. But shows Her Majesty the Queen, Queen Elizabeth II, the late Queen. And then on the obverse side here, we have the Australian Kookaburra, 2017. Let's look at this next one. This is actually a very nice depiction here. The Australian Kookaburra. Beautiful coin, three nines fine silver. And again, the late queen on the reverse. Glad to start adding some of these to the stack. And I think that there's a good place for the Australian Kookaburra one ounce silver coin in my stacking portfolio. So I think we'll get started on probably some more of these over the next coming weeks or months, but glad to have these two Australian kookaburras in the stack. We'll just set these off to the side right here. And let's go ahead and open this. These just came in. These are the HMS Bounty Cook Island coins. Represents $1, one ounce of four nines fine silver. And you can see this is a Cook Islands coin, 2023. I'm just gonna go ahead and take it out of here to get a closer look. So I have a stack of these and I needed some more just to complete the stack. And so I think I picked up seven of these. We're gonna go ahead and open them and make sure. But again, this is a beautiful coin. This is four nines fine silver. And this is the Cook Island coin People call it the ship coin. And this is the HMS Bounty. There was a mutiny on board and a lot of the people on board ended up at the Pitcairn Islands. So pretty cool coin. Glad to have this in the stack. Let's see how many of these we actually have. Okay, folks, there we have it. We've got seven of these Cook Island coins in the collection. Those just arrived. Glad to have those in the stack. And we also have the beautiful Australian kookaburras to go with those. Let's go ahead and open these and let's see what's in these. Ah, uh, more American silver eagles. As you know, the premiums on these have come down and I've told you guys in the past that anytime I get an opportunity to add to my stack of American silver eagles, that I'd go ahead and add to these. Let's see how many American silver eagles I picked up this week. Okay, so it looks as though we picked up five more ounces of American Silver Eagles. And these are the 2023. And as you know, one of those security features is that it has that reeded edge or the missing reed on the 2023. And as you can see, the missing reed is right in this configuration on this coin. And so uh, pretty interesting, uh, not that, good of a security feature, but it's nice to have these in the stack. And I'll continue to stack American Silver Eagles as long as the premium remains low. They're beautiful coins and glad to have those. And then I also picked up some more of the Austrian Philharmonic coins. You'll remember on the last video, I 
purchase some of these and I needed to go ahead and complete my stack of 20 and I was almost there, but I needed a couple more to go ahead and complete that stack. And so I purchased a bit more. And so this has a lot of the stringed instruments on the front and then on the back, this is actually a big pipe organ. And uh, I didn't know that on the last video, but quite a few of you all corrected me, so I appreciate that. But this is a very nice coin, good bullion coin at a good value to add to the stack as well. So let's go ahead and count these out. So there you have it, folks. We have five of these Austrian Philharmonics, and we add that to the five of the American Silver Eagles. We have a total of seven of the Cook Island coins and then two Kookaburra coins. So this brings us to 19 ounces of silver for the stack. But we're not done yet, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and open this box. So after 19 ounces of silver, I figured it's time to add a little bit of gold. Let's see what I picked up. Okay, suspense is building. Oh, wow. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. This is a 1904 US gold $20 Liberty Head Double Eagle. And this is an NGC MS64. Let's just look at that beautiful coin right there. Year 1904 on it. And you can see the beautiful reverse. And this is historic gold right here. This is the year 1904. This is pre-1933 gold. And this has tremendous value. The actual metal content is 0 0.9675 troy ounces. And this is 0 0.900 gold. And it's also got some copper content in it as well. And of course, made by the US Mint in the year 1904. And this is a very beautiful coin. Uh, they don't make these anymore. They don't make them. And so this has the rarity of the gold value and also the rarity of the fact that this is a 194 Liberty Head Double Eagle. So glad to have this in the stack. This will go to the completion of the gold challenge. As you guys might know, I have a gold challenge going on. I was pretty behind and I'm working to catch up. This will go in that stack. I'll link to the gold challenge video right there. And so there you have it, folks. This is the haul for this week. It's not bad. We have 19 ounces of silver. We've got the beautiful Australian kookaburras right here. I've got two ounces of those. I added to my Austrian, Austrian Philharmonic stack. I picked up some more beautiful 2023 American Silver Eagles. And then these remaining seven Cook Island coins are gonna complete my stack of 20 of these Cook Island coins. Glad to complete that stack. It's a nice sense of accomplishment whenever you complete a stack of a round number. And then finally, I was able to get my hands on this very beautiful MS-64 Liberty Head Double Eagle US Mint gold coin. I'm gonna add that as well to the stack. So what did you guys stack this week? Are you stacking gold? Are you stacking silver? What kind of silver are you stacking? Let me know in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the content. And if you don't mind, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Well, that's all I've got for you for today, guys. Until next time, stay blessed and keep stacking.